I probably could have used that blaze to take him out. Don't know. Let's see. Could I have climbed up here? Nope. Well, that's good to know. Alright, let's return to the quarrymen. Uh, any other loot around here? What is in here? Shards and metal burn. Okay, I took care of your situation. Oh, wonderful. Oh, wonderful. Oh. You guys are all just standing there watching me? All right, where are you at, buddy? I love this pit. Yeah, thanks. I've never seen a machine like that. Nor a hunter so bold. Take this. It's from the quarry stores, but no one's gonna argue that you don't deserve it. May you walk in the light, friend. Especially when dealing with what comes up from the ground. I prefer the one about the sun priest falling in love with a merchant's daughter. Nice. Okay. I've seen this four times already. Oh, we are level 29. Alright, let's take a look at our box that we received. And of course we have to save up our skill points because the next one we are going to get is this quiet sprint. Alright, let's look at this treasure box. Oh, I guess I have several treasure boxes here. there's anything really good in there uh, let's see about crafting some of these potions I need some more fatty meat for that I guess we need to kill a few more animals um, is this potions Go ahead and max that out. And that. Craft as many as we can. Antidote. Okay. Alright, guess we're going to Meridian. 
Um, but let me, I want to look at what we have for mods on our outfit. Resist range attack. Seventeen percent ranged attacks, seven percent resist freeze. Um, let's look and see what else we have here. Stealth five percent. Corruption. Melee and resist freeze. Resist shock. Stealth weave. Let's go ahead and put that on. And then for our oops, for our weapons. Let's see if we have any better shock. Go ahead and add that. And let's see what we can do here. Let's swap that out and freeze. That's 26% right now. from the damage adds a little bit of tear let's go ahead and do that yeah all right oh you're in for a treat it's quite a show quick save then let's head to meridian wasted time show was better last week this place. Okay, wait a minute. There's a vantage point that we need to get. Okay, it's on the way. Let's put a marker on it. And it's probably up there because it looks like above my head I can repel down. See. 
I see some things that we could grab onto. You can climb. Oh, the sun is in my face. Hot. Everything's sweating. I know. You just did one heck of a climb there. Oh my gosh. Eight echo shells. Resource supply. Four resource supplies. Fast travel pack and some shock wire, which we're not going to be able to take. Canyon. Okay. Hi, Ma. My plan was to go camping here after the Amos 15 launch. I'd been working OT for the past nine months, so I was pretty frazzled and figured I should take a weekend to relax before Crunch started up again. I was setting up my tent when Wyatt's call came through. He said it was an emergency. I called a lift spin vert and made it to Denver General in less than 27 minutes. I was too late. You'd already slipped into a coma. I didn't understand how that could be, but when I told Wyatt to explain, he just kept choking up, waving me towards the care station. So it was a hollow doc that broke the news. How you'd been diagnosed a year earlier, the adverse reactions to gene therapy and polymer vascular replacements. The six months of mobile dialysis. I couldn't believe you kept it all secret from me, even at the height of crunch. I called you once or twice a week, so you just sat there listening to me enthuse about my latest project or complain about workplace politics, and all the while you were dying. It didn't make sense. I marched back to Wyatt, cornered him, and demanded that he explain. He said you hadn't wanted you hadn't want to distract me that I was doing important work and needed to focus. You know, as though the latest Amos launch in the Palladium and Rhodidium it bring back to Earth mattered more than the Ma who was already here. Wyatt kept saying how proud you were of me. He even parroted that onwards and upwards phrase of yours. He said I should get back to work. That's, that that's what you would have wanted, that he'd stay at the hospital and keep me informed. I didn't go back to work. I called in. I took arguing my way past two supervisors, a labyrinthian automated HR menu, a human resources AI, and an anal defensive benefits executive to activate my personal leave, but I did it. And then I sat at your bedside for the next seven days. I kept thinking of the hospital after my OD at the amphitheater, kept thinking that if you came out of the coma, I wanted my face to be the first thing you saw on the eighth eighth day they pronounced you dead after the funeral I went back to work but I wasn't really there I kept telling myself to focus that it was okay to be there it was what you would have wanted after all onwards and upwards but my work fell behind when my supervisor called me in for an emergency review I told myself to play it cool accept the criticism and promise to do better it didn't go like that I snapped and shouted at him and then broke down, sobbing uncontrollably. Two minutes and three sec drones later, I was standing outside the Faro building, blinking in the sunshine, straightening my bunched up clothes. An alert on my focus indicated that I should go home for the day, then report for a disciplinary review on Monday. But I didn't go home. 
Another idea had risen up in my mind, already fully formed. I guess I'd already been thinking of doing it for a while. I took a lift spin to Pioneer Park. Ten minutes of asking around and a truth test to show I wasn't a cop was all it took to make a connection. I went home with the drugs, started using and didn't stop. Duster, snake, skydive, overcast. No razor wing, at least. I didn't take calls, didn't show up for the disciplinary review on Monday morning. A friend stopped by and hammered the door until I answered it. When he saw what was happening, he staged a one-man intervention. I agreed to go into treatment, but I didn't harbor any illusions. Use of personal leave was bad, but use of psych SA leave. But, but use of psych SA leave? Career suicide. Sure, they couldn't legally fire me for it, but I'd been around FAS long enough to know they'd find a way. My career was over. I thought I was at rock bottom, but I was wrong, of course. I still had a long way to fall. Jeez, man, this family has been through some things. My goodness. Oh. Goodness gracious. It's like a little camp down there. It's, and that's on our way to Meridian. Meridian is huge. Jeez. Well, let's get going. I hope I find some medicine along the way. It's pretty here. And palm trees. It's all nice and green, no snow. Let's get rid of that marker. Hit this campfire. I got going on here. Why are you sitting outside of Meridian? Travelers, feral machines, scared of their own shadows. Unrest everywhere. Hmm. I hear there are many Nora dead and dying. Who are you? Ah, uh, waste of time. Show was better last week. Okay. Yeah, I discovered the campfire already. Who are you? You're just sitting here relaxing. Um, hey. I haven't had a break in ages. A break from what? You're looking well. Hey, we need to kill some of these these critters. So we need some fatty meat isn't up to their usual status. All right, I saw... I saw a boar over here somewhere. Yeah, right here. That's nice. Okay, we can't kill the boars. Can we shoot the boar? Wonderful! Nope. Great. I'm sorry for the wait, but all goods entering the city are subject to search. This is outrageous. We're loyal citizens. How long do we have to wait? What am I supposed to do? Just sit here and let everything spoil? I thought Meridian was open to all, Karja. What happened to Ursa has nothing to do with us. Hmm. Seems to be some commotion going on. Why is there a campfire right here? We just passed. Just be one. patient, and everyone will get in. Eventually. What's going on here? I've heard you Nora women can fight. I'm not looking for trouble. I'm not trying to fight you. What's going on? Can I talk to you? Shadow card, you assassinations. No. What's it got to do with me? Guess not. It's always the ones you least expect to cause you trouble. 
I guess I can't kill you either, turkey. Nope. How long do we have to wait here? All right. Hello. Uh, do I have anything I need to sell? I don't think so. Golden Fast Travel Pack. Very rare. This item provides unlimited fast travel to discovered campfires and settlements throughout the world. Hm. Okay. It requires things that I do not have. Let's get the treasure box. And I know we had a few treasure boxes in here to open. campfire right there. Jeez. Um, let me see. Let me see if I can't buy some more potions from you since I can't craft any. Health boost by 150. Go ahead and buy a couple of those since we have the chill water and the shards for it. Okay, that's full. And we'll get some of these. And get some of those as well. Guess these metal vessels are coming in handy for something. Okay. Let's get a couple more of these. Oh wow, how many can I hold? Quite a few. Those are all full. All right, everything is full now. Thank you. That's right. Can never be too prepared. If I don't get my goods Good to day. buyers soon, they'll cancel the contract. Okay, now let me refresh my memory on these potions. Okay, that restores 150. That's a full health restore. And that's a health boost. Okay. What is going on here? Hello? There are no shadows. If I don't get my foot to fire soon, they'll cancel by. the contract. Some Maseram girl applied What's to the city guard here? the other day. Owen's in there somewhere. Amazing. And so's Erend, that other There's outlander I talked to the night before the proving. Erend said he'd introduce me to his sister if I visited Meridian. Said she was captain of the Vanguard. Avad's peace is brought prosperity. If this keeps up, I'll be it's working always the merchants. Bad or enough, I have Osiron everywhere. But Nora, it's just too much. Wow. The city's locked down on account of the murder. Account of the murder? Hmm. Good luck getting through, Outlander. We'll see about that. 
Anything to see around here? Yeah. Supply crate up there. It's always the ones you least expect. Don't mind me. I'm just going to take your supply crate. You don't want it. This place looks nice. Ooh. Lots of detail. Blood and sacrifice brought about this twilight. Pulse. Talk to the checkpoint he captain. Look happy. No, he doesn't. Are you the checkpoint Stop captain? Stop right there. In light of the recent attack, no stranger passes into Meridian without submitting to search. Recent attack? What are you talking about? The murder of Captain Ursa and her vanguards, of course. Ambushed by Shadow Karja forces in Redridge Pass. Ursa? You mean Aaron's sister is dead? How would you know his name? I know Erend. Summon him. I need to speak to him. Ha! Huh. I doubt that Erend, the new captain of the Vanguard, a man in grief, is going to waste his time on a grimy outlander. Aloy! Hey, you're alive! I thought you were dead! Make way! Make way! All the way to Meridian, just to see me? Have you been drinking? Ah, not really. A little. <laughs> So, you're alive. This, uh, we should celebrate. It drinks on me. We need to talk alone, and you need to pull it together. Right. Over there. So you approve? Of course I approve. From now on, she may come and go from this city as she pleases. As you wish, sir. There. Alone as you asked. And what did you want to tell me? Let's talk about why I'm here. A lot has happened since we last spoke. The Proving was attacked by a group of killers. Not many of us survived. We were in the village when we heard explosions up on the mountain. And some of your braves came back, said most of the contestants were dead. I've never heard such a wail of grief as the sound that rose up from your people. Right. How did you survive? How I survived is less important than how I was targeted. Targeted? What do you mean? The killers came for me because of Olin. What are you talking about? That doesn't make sense. I need to find Olin. I need to know what he knows. But he's a friend. No, he's a traitor. I don't know who the killers are or what they want, but I do know that Olin is working with them. But, I mean, this... I don't need you to understand, Erend. I just need you to take me to him. He's not here. He went scrounging for scrap and relics days ago. It could be anywhere. Are there any places he frequents? Places he returns to? A house. Here in Meridian. Okay, then take me there. I need to search it. I guess. As long as I'm there to witness the search. Okay. Um, your sister. I heard what happened to Ursa. I'm sorry. I know she was special to you. Special to me? <laughs> special to everyone. She always knew what to do. She bossed everyone around. She kept me in line. Now I'm supposed to fill her shoes. And instead, here I am, stumbling around in them. Hmm. Let's see. How do we want to approach this? I don't want to say stop feeling sorry for yourself. That seems kind of mean. Uh, let's say, well, I lost someone too. I, uh, I lost someone too. At the proving, the man who raised me. His name was Rost. That's terrible. Why is it every time something terrible happens? Everyone else tells you the worst thing that ever happened to them, as though that makes it easier. Yeah, why is that? Anyway, there was something you wanted to tell me? 